Hey, what's up guys? I'm Twisted J and this is another segment of Drop Kicking Elbows for you. So Um, here we go. Um which if you guys didn't hear, Daniel Bryan went in for emergency neck surgery, I think it was last week or week before, I don't remember. And he's got till tonight, I think, to the hand in his title which basically means he's pretty much stripped of it after all the hard work which thank god I, I don't wish any harm to him but I, I definitely think that you know I think that if you do things the way you do it um you are going to pay for your consequences and him not being one of the guys that's an A-plus player I really think I, I love the guy's tenacity I love his his grit and oh he's even a little bit more like Stone Cold now oh he doesn't even give a rat about anything um but that was, I think it was two weeks ago that he had surgery. Two weeks this Thursday that he had the surgery done. And he showed up last week and said he wasn't giving up the title unless. Which, if they have to, they'll just be beat the living hell out of him for it so that should be cool um another thing shield versus um oh god triple h's group um evolution going one on one seeing who the top click is in that there which basically they brought back batista to do the reunion of evolution which really hasn't been a good call um and Orton being the little bitch that he's been lately um I I could care less I could really care less about where they're going with the storyline it's so cheesy right now that it's just like the only good thing that's going around is the fact that John Cena is making Bray Wyatt's career right now which is even better because John Cena is the new CM Punk of or, or no he's the new Chris Jericho of last year as to what CM Punk was like a couple of years ago before he went on that long 434 championship Day championship run um, so um, but it's 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 starting to pick up but it's still not what I am so used to watching um, and another one um, like I said, you've got the Shield versus Evolution, which has been a, been a really, really interesting thing to watch. Um, let's see, who else is there? <sighs> no Miz info, which I think is probably a better thing because they're kind of giving him a break. Um, let's see who else is there. Um, um, I already did Bray Wyatt, I did The Shield, um, Daniel Bryan, um, segment, which, I hope you get better if you're watching this, Daniel DB. So, um, 
Other than that, there really hasn't been anything interesting going on with the WWE. Um, on the opposite end of the wrestling world, you've got TNA, which is just, ugh. I think it's just a complete disorganized mess. Mess. Since Sting left, and I think Kurt Angle's out for a while. So, um, and I think it's gotten even worse than what it could. And then you find out why Dixie really didn't want MVP taken over. Because he's, he's gone through and pulled a total Bobby Roode on us. Which I, I really wouldn't be surprised if they turned Bobby Roode into a baby face again, which I doubt they'll do, but because of this, but they did turn Austin Aries back into a baby face or a good guy again. Um, after all the stuff MVP's done, you kind of had a feeling that he was going to be back in the ring full time anyway. So, um, I know there's no more wrestling news about me. Um, I am officially retired due to back problems. Um, and I don't see a near future for it. Maybe, I don't know, maybe train a couple new guys. That's about it. But, other than that, that's the end of the drop kick and elbow show. And I, I want you guys to check out Batgirl Jamie's show and the Juglats Are Us. And even check out a little bit of Juglat Viper, our friend D. Because she she really could use some views and Eventually, she'll get around to making some more videos, so I'm Twisty J, and this is Dropkick and Elbows. So, there you guys go. Get your wrestling updates.